Good afternoon. I have a Acer Aspire 1551-4560 that I dropped. You can see up here that the, I broke the LCD. Ordered a new one from ScreenCountry.com. Great service. Anyway, I'm going to show you how to repair broken screen. First thing we have to do is shut down the computer here. I'm also going to unplug it from the power supply. While it's shutting down here, I'll go ahead and let you know I took a credit card. The only thing you should need for this is a credit card and a Phillips screwdriver. I took a credit card or any other heavy plastic card should help and I slowly worked the bezel off the computer here going around each side. There's no screws holding it on like some models you'll find. Um, you get it down here, pop it off, the, you see the bezel just comes off. It's got these little plastic clips, especially on the corners down here you have to be real gentle till you can just kind of pop it off. So you use the credit card to get underneath it and then loosen it with your finger. Before I go ahead and start working on the screen here, I'm going to turn the laptop over, unlock the battery, release it here so we have no power going to the computer itself. I'm going to open up the computer once again here. I'm going to lay the screen down here and loosen these two screws that are holding this on. Move it out. You can see what I'm doing here. This will allow the LCD should allow it to pivot here momentarily. Got a couple more screws it looks like down here. I am by no means a computer expert. I just know that I needed to uh, get this replaced and I wasn't going to pay to have someone else do it. So now you can see I can lift the screen here away from this here. Where'd my other screw go? There we go. So this allows me to get at my screen. I have to be real gentle with these here. So now I can work my microphone out here very gently. new screen from Screen Country. You can see it's the perfect size. Everything should fit just fine here. I'm going to take this off. I'm trying to preserve the sticky here. Maybe 
very gentle trying to get this up here. Let's tape up. because you don't want this accidentally coming loose. It should reveal this connector. It needs to come on. This is a very gentle connection here, so you got to be careful with it. So now I've disconnected screen here. I'm going to take the screws out that are actually holding the LCD in place. So here I have removed the broken LCD, set that aside, I'm going to take the new LCD from ScreenCountry.com, I recommend them. Um, it's the first time that I have attempted to replace a laptop screen LCD on my own, but their service was really good, fast shipping, didn't give me any trouble. Started. Let's come down here. Kind of feel like the fumble fingers Finnegan here. I'm just getting these screws started. I'm not putting them in all the way until I get these four set in. Okay, so I now have screen back in. I'm going to reconnect this connection down here very gently. Since it's so fragile. snapped in just like it was supposed to. Put the sticky back down here. These are still laying here so now I'm going to take it back into this tray. Lifting my video camera. Up, making sure those tabs are down. So now, make sure that this reaches over the way it's supposed to. Got that lined up. Got the camera lining up the way that it's supposed to here.
once again I have to stress I am definitely a first timer at this I was intimidated at first but thought man it can't be that hard at least on this Acer it appears to be that way I was a little intimidated at first because I couldn't find any instructions on how to do this. And in all honesty, getting that bezel off was the, the scariest part for me. Um, just because it, it really didn't seem like it wanted to come off. Now I'm going to take this screen protector off here. And just make sure that I can get that off the way that I need to. Now, I'm not going to put the bezel on yet. I'm going to, to test the computer and make sure that the screen is working the way that it should be before I put that bezel back on, because in all honesty, that was the hardest part to get off. At this point, I have replaced the LCD. Um, question is, I can already tell the screen is working the way that it's supposed to. So I'm going to put the bezel back on here. You can hear it just clipping in as I go around. There you go, I'm back at my logging screen where I started. Coming up on 13 minutes, first time ever try. Again, if you got a broken LCD, at least on an Acer Aspire 1551-4560, go over to ScreenCountry.com. Best price I could find on the internet. Excellent shipping, and you know, just take that credit card, pop off that bezel. You saw the steps that I went through first time, no practice. Pretty impressed. I got my computer all back up and running. Uh, wouldn't trade it for anything. Uh, you can comment if you got a question or message me and I'll do what I can to respond and I if you got a broken screen I wish you the best and definitely go for it don't let it intimidate you all I needed was a screwdriver I did use a toothpick a little bit to help uh, get a little of that sticky stuff off the back when I was connecting it but nothing major